Hey guys, welcome back to another one of my videos. Now today, um, I am very excited as this is going to be a, a really ex exciting video. So um, in the last video, James asked me if I would like to buy his uh, tractor. And well, um, I came home, I thought about it and um, yes, I do want to buy his uh, tractor. So yeah, we are heading over there and um, well, buying a tractor or um, eight thousand pound so yeah that is going to be um the uh, most profitable for the uh, farm so yeah so yeah this is going to be a very exciting video as we are going to finally own a second tractor which can actually pull the uh, cultivator but um yeah that's not as exciting so yeah we are almost there just around this um, corner here check if no cars are coming no we are clear to go so um yeah as you guys can tell i am really excited so um yeah this is going to be a um, really good uh, video this one so yeah but um anyways there it is on our left our almost new tractor so let's get in here so anyways guys i'm going to uh, buy the tractor so see you in a second right well um guys as you can see my bank account it went from ten thousand to two thousand so that means that we have bought a new tractor so the keys are ours and well so is the tractor so let's just um park um the fence up here and then we're going to um, get the uh, case back to the farm and then walk back for the um, the fent. So just park it up. That should be good right there. So see you in a sec. Right, well we are in the uh, case tractor. Our new tractor. Which is really exciting. And um, well yeah. So here it is, um, if you are wondering, it is in extremely good condition. It is a bit dirty, but I mean, that is the least of our worries. So, as you can see, it is a wonderful tractor. It really is wonderful, a wonderful tractor. So yeah, I am uh, really excited about this. Uh, this is a, um, well, this is, well, basically a life changer, honestly, I mean, you know, owning two tractors is going to uh, change the uh, farm quite a bit. So um, let's look to see if we're clear. We're just going to uh, wait for that car. As I mean, um, we can spend uh, longer in the uh, tractor at least. <laughs> so uh, yeah. But I mean, this is a lovely tractor to drive. Although it is, it isn't fast as my uh, Fent. But I mean, it is still a lovely tractor to uh, to uh, drive, you know. So yeah, and the brakes as well, very nice. This tractor, I mean, it surprises me because my tractor and this tractor have one thing in common. Um, they are they are both old, and um, both of them are really good tractors, you know. So yeah, I am really impressed with uh, both of them. So yeah, this tractor was really a great purchase, you know. So um, yeah, but I mean, while we are here, um, I am going to uh, give it a quick wash. So it is going to be nice and clean, although we're going to do cultivation with this right after. So yeah, but let's get it washed. So yeah. Right, well, um, this is uh, nice and clean now. Let me just show you guys the exterior. See, nice and clean, that. Very nice. Very nice now. So, uh, yeah. But, um, let's get it back into the, um, the farm. And then, well, we have to walk back for the FN tractor. So, I not sure where I'm I am going to uh, park this I mean probably just you know by the uh, cow shed as I do with the uh, fan tractor as well but um 
yeah so park it up like that and um well guys it is time for a uh, big walk so see you guys in a sec right well um that was a um long and uh, tiring walk back to um james's place and um well yeah but um the main uh, thing is that we have both of our tractors now so we're going to uh, take this back to the um farm uh, no cars are coming and um yeah once we're at the farm we are well probably going to put our new case tractor onto the uh, cultivator and cultivate the field next to the um, the shed and then we're also probably going to be able to um, seed both of the uh, fields um, the one that we will cultivate and also the uh, the big one so um, yeah we're probably going to um, be done that at about 10 o'clock so then we can head into the farmhouse have a sleep and then um, tomorrow we are going to um, harvest um, that field that is on our right you just about can't see it but um, yeah we're going to uh, harvest that and then now uh, yeah that's going to um, be the end of uh, today's um, video so um, anyways let's just um, go in reverse and uh, try and not hit the um, the big shed so big cow shed and and right there, there we go that should do us so um anyways let's uh, quickly jump into the uh, case tractor right well um hi guys so um we are in the uh, case tractor so um it is time to um put our new tractor onto some uh, work so um yeah um the cultivator is just around here and um back up onto it and there we go it is attached so we are going to um cultivate this field and then well see that so um let me just um get it into the uh, correct position real quick right so um the cultivator is very straight so um yeah we are ready to uh, start work so um i have detached the uh, front weight also because um, the rear uh, the cultivator might be just a bit too heavy for it but um, anyways we are going to uh, turn the radio on I am just going to uh, cut the spit out so see you guys once we are done right well um, that was quite tiring but um, we are done so um, yeah the reason I didn't include it is because you guys have seen me uh, cultivate that field many many times so um thought it would probably just get boring so yeah that's why I didn't show it but um here we are um so I don't really like doing uh, cultivation um or seeding really but uh, harvesting I do like I do like the uh, harvesting but um now it is um well, we're going to just have a wee, um, look at the, um, the big field and then we are going to get it seeded. So, yeah, it really is massive, you know, but um, let's um, get seeder and um, get it seeded. So, um, yeah, that's going to be a very nice and, um, yeah, well, it's going to be very nice. So, the seeder is uh, parked just here next to the uh, cow shed with no actual cows in because we can't afford them but um <laughs> yeah so let's get um on to right so there we go we are on the cedar and we are um almost ready to start work now we just um need to move over to where the field is and then we can start the work so um I, that was a bush um don't worry it wasn't a tree just a bush so i am also going to uh, cut this bit out as it is going to be quite boring so see you guys once i am done right well um there we are guys all done uh both fields are nice and seeded and um yeah we did get uh, finished earlier than i thought 
but um, hey, we are still going to do the uh, seating in um, to and uh, tomorrow because I mean, if we get it started, it will probably be night time, which you know isn't the best for a vlogging. So yeah, but um, yeah, so. I thought we would uh, be done by 10 o'clock, but now it's actually um, 8.30, so yeah, don't know why we managed that, but I um, guess we were quite fast. So, um, as we have all this time, we should probably go um, visit the uh, guy at the uh, horse paddocks, and also uh, James, just, you know, I'll ask him what it's like without a tractor, you know, so... Um, yeah, that is going to be um, our goal for um, this evening. And then after that we are, well, as you know, going to have a nice sleep and then um, harvest the field and, um, tomorrow. So, here we are. Just approaching on these um, very uh, tight um, roads. So, right, well, um, I'll have a conversation. Right, so... Yeah, I had a nice wee uh, discussion with him. Um, not much has happened really. Um, yeah, he's not um, the most fun guy to um, talk with, but I mean, you know, I mean he 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 is nice, so um, that's always a uh, positive. So um, yeah, no one is coming, so we are good to go now. Um, What I was going to say was um, that we might actually start the uh, harvesting tonight, but um, that probably wouldn't be a uh, good idea, really, as um, it is going to be night time, um, and, well, shortly, so, um, yeah, so we are sticking to the uh, plan of harvesting um, tomorrow morning, so, um, here we are, next to his um, uh, livestock trailer, and um, well, yeah, let me get in, and um, we'll have a nice wee conversation with him. Right, so um, hi guys. So um, did have a conversation with him, and he asked me uh, one question. Um, he asked me if, well, James asked me if I would like to help him move away. Or if I don't want to help him move away. What should Dan Pot for 22? Should he help James move away with all his stuff or don't help James move away? Your choice will influence the whole storyline, so choose wisely. Right, well, um, I had a nice sleep after last night after all of the cultivation and the seeding. But um, today, as you guys know, it is time to uh, jump into the New Holland Combine and, well, get the field harvested. Right, so um, here we are back in the uh, lovely um, New Holland Combine Harvester. And, um, yeah, I really do uh, love this combine. So, um, might as well show you guys the uh, interior a bit more. So, there you go. All your buttons and levers and a uh, big grain tank at the back. Um, AC, radio, um, well, the seat of course, the unreal, um, let me actually show you guys the exterior of this as well. Right, so, um, so you can see, there it is, looking all big and mighty, um, so yeah, I really do love this combine from, um, inside and outside, you know, it is very great, but, um, the point of today's video isn't just to uh, look at the uh, beautiful combine, it is to um, get the field harvested. So, uh, yeah. Now, um, we are just going to uh, quickly reverse back and... Right, that should do it. So, let's get it started up and there we go. So, um... This is going to be a um, fun job for um, this morning. Well, I say morning, but it is quite late. But, um, 
Anyways, um, I do enjoy doing the uh, harvesting, so this time I'm not going to cut it out. I am going to turn the radio on in the cab. Some grace on the 
fifth wheel face and lights and pipes and lights Go on the Delphi in Dublin City like New York City at night Hauling for the council with air bikes bouncing the tipping ram still up Had to tip the loan while still on the go cause I hadn't got time to stop Hauling mail and grain on boats and trains and oil and bikes and drink And driving like hell and to the self propel and hoping she don't sink If your loved ones out from home on the bouncing get super humped and boots Buy a loaf and a V8 coat and 20 laps for the roof 50 ton plus and 40 foot behind 24-7 on the O and 9 And baby, I'm coming back to you Slip the clutch and the fun Those talk from heading for the boat Well, I never say goodbye to the woman this time But I left for a no Well, I'm up three steps in heaven Well, on the high with a hell And I know it'll be a while before say goodbye Cause I know you're looking well Tunnel down the M1 when the limit of fuse didn't melt. When the woman rang and said, Sorry, Tang, but you know I met someone else. With two chrome stacks thrown up the back on the bank flat out in top. My only fear in a non to steer would it get her stopped at the dock. Right, Joe, honey, got the hammer to the floor. If that's your 20, that's a big 10 4. But baby, I'm still coming back to you. Slip the clutch in the fun, no stop. I'm heading for the phone. Well, I never said goodbye to the woman this time But I left for the door Well, I'm up three steps in heaven Well, on the high with the hell And I know it'll be a while before I say goodbye Cause I know you're looking well Right, so, um, hi guys So, um, as you can see we are just about done And, um, this has taken me all day as um, I woke up later than I expected. I expected to wake up around 7 but then um, I only got around to doing it at uh, 1 o'clock because I thought that um, since I just bought the case I might as well just take it over to the uh, dealership so they can just check it out just so if everything is alright, everything feels alright but you know just in case something is wrong. So. Uh, for the people wondering where it is, that's where it is. So, um, yeah, that's why we uh, started um, the uh, harvesting later. But, um, anyways, let's just dump it all in the uh, trailer. Now, yeah, there's um, some in there because I am planning to put quite a lot in and then sell it once it is about halfway full. Um, and, um, yeah, so. Uh, this is going to, oh, no, it's not going to uh, take a while, it is done. So, um, yeah, let's uh, park up the uh, harvester, and then we're going to have a sleep, and then we'll um, get the uh, case back um, in, uh, tomorrow. So, um, let me just reverse it um, back in there real quick, um, as straight as I can, which isn't too straight, but, um, right. Um, close enough. No, I need to straighten it up a bit just so um looks better. Right, so pull it forward a bit and just hold on. Right, so now it just right there we go. So there's part of oh, that is still not straight. Right, um. Well, that's as straight as we are going to get it, but um, anyways, um, I'm gonna have a nap, so see you guys uh, tomorrow. Right, so, um, well, it is um, the next day, and um, the uh, dealership said that I um, I can collect it by 10, so it is um, exactly 10 right now, so, um, yeah, we are heading over and, well, collecting the case, so... Uh, let's check if we're clear we are perfect and um well yeah get the case back so um there it is look at her oh looking so nice but um let's just quickly uh, park up in a place that isn't in the way 
Right, well, um, let's jump into Kate's tractor. Right, so, um, here we are back in the uh, lovely Kate's tractor. And I have one inside and they told me that everything is as it should be. There is not a single problem with the, with the uh, tractor. So, yeah, that is absolutely great. So, uh, yeah. So, um... I keep on forgetting that I can't see anything when I am coming out of the uh, dealership, so, um, yeah. But, um, anyways, let's just, uh, park it up next to the, uh, cow shed. And, well, um, it's time to, uh, just walk back across to the uh, dealership and, um, retrieve the fan tractor. Right, so, here we are, back in the fan tractor, so, um... Let's get her back to the farm and then we are going to uh, end today's video. So, um... Oh, there's the car coming, but, um, we are fast, so, yeah. Um, right, well, um, also park it up, so... Um, yeah, hold on, just real nice. Oh, um, there we go. Right, so we are going to um, end off today's video in the uh, case tractor. Uh, see you once I jump in. Right, well, um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know I sure did. So I'll uh, see you guys in the next video. Until then, goodbye.